The first female state trumpeter to play at a British royal wedding today said it was a dream come true. Lance Corporal Kate Sanford, from the band of the Household Cavalry, will help sound the fanfare to mark the arrival of Meghan Markle as she takes her first steps inside St. George's Chapel tomorrow. In the process she will make royal history. The 29-year-old from Windsor said, We're all so proud and feel very privileged to be part of the fanfare team. We've had quite a few rehearsals. Whenever we are at work we pick up our trumpets and have a rehearsal. It means an awful lot. To get picked for something so prestigious makes you feel very lucky. It's a dream come true, Claire Tack, owner of Violet Bakery in Hackney, East London, puts finishing touches to the cake for the wedding of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle in the kitchens at Buckingham Palace A Jaguar convertible with a union flag paint scheme and life-size cardboard cutouts of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle is parked in Windsor Royal fans wave flags from the window of a Marks & Spencer store above a banner referring to the wedding Indian painter Jagjot Singh. Rubel touches up his painting of Prince Harry, Elle, and Meghan Markle ahead of their royal wedding A cardboard cut out of Britain's Queen Elizabeth stands behind Union flags on the crowd control barriers near Windsor Castle Royal fans camp out on the streets of Windsor Souvenirs featuring Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are displayed in a Windsor gift shop Kensington Palace update with the news that the Prince of Wales will accompany Meghan Markle down the aisle at her wedding to Prince Harry. Four-year-old George high-fives an armed police officer in Windsor A Philip Barnard Brown, senior coachman at the Buckingham Palace Muse, leads a Windsor Grey, one of the four horses that will pull the carriage at the wedding of Prince. Harry and Meghan Markle, past the Ascot Landau carriage, at the Royal Muse at Buckingham Palace School Children in uniform wave union flags outside Windsor Castle James Vivian, director of music at St. George's Chapel in Windsor directs the street. George's Chapel Choir during a rehearsal before even song and ahead of the wedding police officers prepare road closures outside Windsor Castle The Royal Kitchen at Windsor Castle where preparations are underway for the reception banquet after the wedding Alice Lawton, project manager at Mission Invertebrate, inspects plants at the Royal Parks Nursery in Hyde Park where flowers are being grown for the wedding members of the household Calvary. Ready for inspection in the regimental square during a facility to see the Household Cavalry Mounted Regiment preparations for the forthcoming royal wedding at Hyde Park Barracks A general view of Windsor Castle the reverse of the new coin design that will commemorate the next occasion for the British royal family, the wedding of His Royal Highness, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle taking place at Street. Georgia Euro Trademark Stein S. Chapel, Windsor Castle, Windsor State Trumpeters play in the Regimental Square during a facility to see the Household Cavalry Mounted Regiment preparations for the forthcoming Royal Wedding at Hyde Park Barrack to Windsor Grays, which will pull the carriage at the wedding of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, are groomed at the Royal Muse. Buckingham Palace A royal fan sleeps outside Windsor Castle A media stand is erected halfway along the long walk at Windsor Castle as it prepares for the royal wedding armed police officers in Windsor speak with members of the public ahead of the wedding street art of Prince Harry and Ms. Meghan Markle by Pegasus on the wall of hair Square during a preview to see the Household Cavalry Mounted Regiment preparations for the forthcoming Royal Wedding at Hyde Park Barracks work continues along the long walk in front of Windsor Castle ahead of the wedding cardboard cutouts of Prince Harry and his fiancée U.S. actress Meghan Markle sit among royal memorabilia in a gift shop widow ahead of the couple's wedding in Windsor uniforms in the full dress store during a preview to see the Household Cavalry Mounted Regiment preparations for the forthcoming Royal Wedding at Hyde Park Barracks a window display commemorates the upcoming wedding of Prince Harry and his Beyonce U.S. actress Meghan Markle in Windsor members of the Household Cavalry works in the tailor's shop during a preview to see the Household Cavalry Mounted Regiment preparations for the forthcoming Royal Wedding at Hyde Park Barracks Craftsman Deacon of the Royal Electrical Engineer stands near an Apache attack helicopter during a photo call to display the involvement of three Regiment Army Air Corp in ceremonial duties during the Royal Wedding of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle at Wattisham Airfield three Regiment Army Air Corps practice marching at Wattisham Airfield in Suffolk as they prepare for 
for the forthcoming Royal Wedding O work continues along the long walk in front of Windsor Castle 3 Regiment Army Air Corps led by Lieutenant Colonel and English at Waddisham Airfield in Suffolk as they prepare for the forthcoming Royal Wedding people gather outside a pub decorated to mark the upcoming wedding of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle the changing of the guard ceremony takes place through the streets of Windsor ahead of the wedding of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle Royal fans awake at first light having spent the night outside of Windsor Castle Windsor Castle through the morning mist she will be joined by her husband, Lance Corporal Julian Sanford in the Elite Six Person Band. State trumpeters wear long gold coats and are often seen at major state events or anniversaries. Mrs. Sanford is employed as a cornet and trumpet player. She is also the only harpist within the Corps of Army Music and is often called upon to assist the other bands and orchestras. Mr. and Mrs. Sanford, who married in December, will also be the first married couple to perform the duty. She said her, cool as a cucumber, husband helped her with her confidence. The royal wedding procession in detail she added, the household cavalry is an all-male regiment but women have been in the band since the mid-90s. For everyone else it seems a marvel, but for us we are just doing our job to the best of our ability. I'm sure it matches the men. Mrs. Sanford started playing the trumpet age date and was in her university's brass band. Two bandmates played a fanfare at her wedding when she walked down the aisle.